My name is Jelly, and welcome to my YouTube studio. Now I play video games for a living. That means I don't have a studio anything compared to the size of Mr. Beast or Chris. Hey, come on, man. I'm trying to work here. All I need is a very comfortable area for me to play video games in. Over the last six months, I hired an architect to build me the craziest YouTube studio that any gamer would want. So I present to you the Jelly Studio. Look, we even have a customized logo on a sound panel. That's my name. The room comes with the remote. This remote controls the lighting of this room. You can make it any color you want. But uh, personally, I prefer something like this, green. It's very nice. But we don't just have lights on the ceiling or behind the logo. We even have lights on the walls. And that is for the entire room. Now I'm gonna be honest, the studio is maybe like 95% finished. We have some finishing touches that we have to do on, for example, the light switches. This is ugly. Plugs on the walls, even like some paint touch-ups here and there. But I thought I would show it to you anyway. Obviously, the most important part about this studio is my desk. Now my desk is a completely custom made design. That's right. Nobody else has this desk in the entire world. It's not only a custom desk, it also goes up. It also goes down. If I want to record videos while standing, I can. But I'm not that tall, so technically the desk wouldn't have to go up that much. But anyway, if you look behind the desk, there are no cables. Oh my God, can you believe it? I did cable management. I organized. Now this desk, like I said, is completely custom made. So what we did, we actually have a channel inside of the desk specially designed for cables. The only cable you will see is obviously the cable of my headset, like that. I need my sound and wireless headsets suck, let's be honest. And the occasional, you know, iPhone charger. There's nothing wrong with the studio. We totally have perfect internet connection. Now, before we go into more specifics about the hardware stuff of God over here, all of you are probably wondering, Jelly, where's your window? You want to look outside, see the birds. Well, we have a window. It's very nice. I can't hear them, though, because this room is completely sound isolated. I could kidnap someone, put them here. No one will ever know. <laughs> this isn't GTA 5 in real life, is it? Let's show you what I've got over here. First of all, we've got my beautiful chair. This is a Herman Miller. I'll leave all the notes, everything in the description of this video in case you wanna, in case you wanna look. It's very comfortable. You see, I sit on this for a good eight hours per day. It's very important that I got a good chair, good posture. We've got a Corsair K55, which is a very cheap keyboard. I specifically went for a cheap keyboard so that I could replace it constantly. Because I always break mine. Uh, we got a wired mouse. We have an iPhone charging cable, very important. We've got two 24 inch monitors. I went for 24 inch specifically because I need to have enough space for my camera and webcam to film me on a straight line. If my monitor's too big, my camera will have to look down upon me because I'm a short guy, okay? That basically explains that. We got a Rode Broadcaster. Uh, I've always used this mic, it's very nice. We've got a Bayer Dynamic DT1770 Pro. We've got a custom PC, which is beautiful, but at the same time, white. Maybe I'll replace the case with a black one, so it kind of like blends into the room a little bit better. And then we've got our mixer module, which I, I don't really know what, what it does. I had somebody install it for me and it works, okay? Then we've got these two beautiful lights that make me look really beautiful. Uh, we've got a nice webcam, uh, a nice camera. It's a Canon LG40, I believe. So this glossy black desk actually has a built-in mouse pad made out of fake leather. We didn't want to use real leather because why would you? You don't need that. Uh, but we got fake leather as a mouse pad, which is really cool. Also, obviously the monitors are hanging on a monitor arm. It looks much cleaner that way. There's no cables. There's no ugliness. There's no nothing. Uh, and then more jelly logos. That's right. We've got me lit up again. This roof is sloping, so it makes sense, right? But look, I can turn it off. I can also make it red, but that would be evil. This is evil jelly. We don't want to see that. These sound panels are actually completely custom made. I chose them to be kind of like a bronze gold color because I feel like it's a very warm and nice color. It also works with the floor. And then we chose this dark black Alcantara fabric. Not only does it look nice, it also really helps with the sound. And obviously, you know, they're connected to a wooden panel that the lighting is behind. It's 
all very smart, very techy, but it works and it's cool and nobody hears me. Obviously, even the door is completely custom made. The door itself is soundproof. So nobody outside of the door will be able to hear me record uh, video games. The handle, however, I also need to order a new handle. Okay, that's like part of the 5% not finished. It looks, it looks bad. I know, okay? It's because I placed this custom sound panel on it that the handle didn't fit anymore. <laughs> so, yeah. small details, small details. And that's basically it. That's my YouTube studio. I hope you liked it. In case you didn't, click it in front of the video. Do it now. Because this one's over.